Curtis Tate. I am the overnight supervisor at Covered House of Pennsylvania, and I'm also the president of Status Quo's Three M's, which stands for Men, Mentor, and Men. Um, as many people might know, um, Covenant House is a non-profit um, organization um, that service um, Philadelphia and the Delaware Valley. We actually like the biggest organization for under 21 youth in the Delaware Valley. Um, primarily, my role as being overnight supervisor is that Covenant House is a 365 day a year, 24 hour, seven days a week facility. So a lot of times, um, young people throughout um, Philadelphia might find themselves in a position to where they don't have any place to go. So pretty much my goal is to facilitate that young people under the age of 21 will have a safe place to be on the street, come in, um, give them something to eat, talk to them a little while, just pretty much assess their immediate needs. Um, status quo is a nonprofit grassroots organization. We're in the Philadelphia Ride community. Um, Status Quo is actually an acronym for uh, Streets Taking Action to Unite Strength. Um, status, we use the um, Status Quo because pretty much it means before the war. The things were before the war. The things, and when you look at context of the city of Philadelphia, we just want to help restore Philadelphia back to that, you know, place where you know, before all the crime, before all the blight, before all the drugs came in, that it takes a village to raise a child, or um, when you got in trouble on the block, you know, you, you, the, the, the guy that owned the mom and pop store might um, straighten you out, then the old lady on the corner might straighten you out, and then they called your mom at work and told your mom you got in a little trouble, and then your mom got into you, then you had the big punishment when pops came home. Um, like I said, um, in status quo, we have subgroups. My subgroup is, um, like I said before, men mentoring men, which stands for three M's. We just a small group of brothers that's willing to make it, that's trying to make a change. Nothing major, just trying to make a change. First off, we mentor ourselves as brothers. Um, you know, I always refer to we climbing up a wall. And you know, our ultimate goal is to get to the top of that wall. I might be a little bit in front of one of my brothers. I might have to pull them up and vice versa. So basically that just um, my impact on the community. And I guess what I'd like to leave is, you know, um, this last four years of Barack Obama has just been interesting. And the thing I love about Barack Obama is his effect on pop culture. His effect on pop culture to me is that, you know, he teaches young men that you can be intelligent and be successful. You look at Barack Obama, everything he has accomplished because he's an intelligent man. Didn't play basketball, he's not a rapper, he's not an actor, which I have no problem with any of those things, but he shows, you know, guys that look like me that, you know, if we just hit the books and we just be dedicated, that we can be successful.